go to the library and talk to a trained librarian who will be more than happy to help you find good quality information on your topic. And where might you start? Well, first thing you can do is look at textbooks. So every course is going to have textbooks that are relevant to the topic. In my case, I teach anatomy to the first years, so I've got here anatomy and physiology for veterinary technicians. So this book is written by experts, it's specific to your topic, it's going to contain good quality information that's going to be reliable and accurate. So if you use, use something like that for your topic, you'll have good quality material to base your work on. Other options in the library, you'll also find lots of journals. So scientific publishers every month or every three months will publish these paper journals that have articles in them looking at new and current research on whatever topic you're, you're researching. The problem with these is that there's thousands and thousands of them. So rather than you having to go to the library, you won't find every single journal known to man there, but you will find a collection of them that will get you started. The third place you can go if you want more information is to look for a database. So the library, for example, has databases like Science Direct, where they take all the articles that are published in, say, scientific fields and put them together into a big database that you can then search. So rather than going on to Google and finding thousands and millions of irrelevant articles, in this case, you can find articles that are written by experts in the field. The information they contain is accurate and up-to-date, it's reliable, and it will give you good quality information to base your assignment on. So if you follow those three tips, you hopefully end up doing well on your assignments and getting a good grade.